What's up guys, so I'm gonna show you how you could get more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2 super easily and fast. But real quick, I am gifting tons of you guys whatever you do want from the Fortnite item shop, including the Season 2 Battle Pass. So if there is something that you do want right now from the Fortnite item shop, just subscribe with the notifications, like the video, and then go and comment your Epic Games Gamer Tag and what you do want from the Fortnite item shop. And I'm going to be gifting tons of you guys whatever you do want from the Fortnite item shop. And also, guys, if you would like to support the channel, please consider using support a creator code YGT inside of the Fortnite item shop. Hashtag ad. But now let's go ahead and get straight in to how you could go ahead and basically get more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2 super, super easily and super, super fast. So we're just going to go ahead and get straight to the points. So let's get started with this, guys. So the first thing we want to do, we want to make our way into Battle Royale main lobby and open up this menu, just like how I have right here, right now. So you make your way to the Battle Royale main lobby, you look at the top left of your screen, you're going to see three lines, and you want to go ahead and click on this menu button, just like how I have right here, right now. Now, once we are inside of this menu, just like how I am right here, right now, what we are going to want to go ahead and do to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2, super, super easily and super, super fast, guys, we are going to go ahead and basically go up here, we're going to see all these different options, so we're going to see our Epic Games Gamer tag, we're going to see our ad tags, Battle Royale Lobby, your online status, which is going to tell you whether you are online or if you are offline. Then underneath that, we're going to go ahead and basically see our party joinability, which is going to say whether that is friends only or invite only or public, right? And then underneath that, we're going to see our participation, which is going to go ahead and basically say whether we are playing or we are not playing, and then underneath that, we're going to see looking for party, which is going to go ahead and say off or on, so whether we are looking for a party or whether we are not looking for a party, and then underneath that, we're going to go ahead and basically see privacy, and it's going to go ahead and say matchmaking region, friends only, everybody, or nobody, then underneath that, we're going to go ahead and basically see a language, which is going to say public, private, or friends only can see your language. Then underneath that, we're going to see our passes, which is going to go ahead and say whether that is set to private or whether that is set to public. And then underneath that, we're going to go ahead and basically see our mutual friends, which is going to say whether that is public, friends only, or private, nobody. And then underneath that, we're going to see our friends, we're going to see our PlayStation Network, our Epic Online, we're going to see all of our different friends and all that sort of stuff, we're going to see Away, we're going to see whether they're all offline or online, all that sort of stuff. Then underneath that, we're going to see Add Friends, and it's going to say Friend Invites, and it's going to say Accept All Friend Requests, and you're going to see a whole bunch of different friend requests. Then underneath that, we're going to go ahead and basically see Looking for Party, and... It's going to say looking for parties, a new way to find players based on your common social tags. Add social tags to your profile now and look for party to start finding players. And it's going to say add tags and looking for party. Then under that, you're going to see voice chat, game chat, party channel, voice options, all that sort of stuff. Then under that, you're going to see menu with all these options. And under that, we're going to see exit. So we want to go underneath voice chat and above exit over to here. So come over here where it says menu. Then go above legal, above support and refunds, above reporting, above parental controls over here towards where it says settings. Now we're just about to go ahead and get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2 super, super easily and super, super fast. So what we are going to want to go ahead and do now, guys, once we are like in, in this sort of option, right? Just like how I am right here, right now. So you guys just want to go ahead and basically make your way into this. You guys want to just go ahead and basically, um, what do you call it? Um, what do you call it? And then once you go ahead and basically go over here, you guys want to make your way into the menu option. And then when you come in the menu, you're going to see all these things. You're going to see video with a monitor, game with a gear, game UI with like a UI sort of menu, touch and motion with like a hand. And then we're going to see um, mouse and keyboard with like a mouse and keyboard. And then we're going to see controller options with like a 
controller and a gear and then to the right of that we're gonna see audio with like a microphone and then we're gonna see keyboard controls we're going to see controller and we're going to see account privacy with a character picture now to go ahead and get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of fortnite season 2 super super easily and super super fast we're going to go to the right of video to the right of game to the right of game ui to the right of touch and motion to the right of mouse and keyboard to the right of controller options to the right of audio to the right of keyboard controls, to the right of controller, all the way over to the very, very right tab. So you guys want to go all the way over past all of those different options to the very, very right tab, all the way over here where it does go ahead and say account and privacy with the character picture at the top right of your screen. So now once we are over on this tab, just like how I am right here right now, to go ahead and get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2 super, super easily and super, super fast, what we are going to want to go ahead and basically do. So we're going to see account... We're going to see social privacy, we're going to see gameplay privacy, we're going to see credits, which is going to say Fortnite credits and view, and it's going to say see everyone who contributed to the making of Fortnite, and then under that we're going to see legal information, and we're going to see view, and it's going to say legal information, view legal information. So we're going to see all of, this, all, all of these different things under account. We're going to see Epic account, logout, recent purchases, player surveys. Under that we're going to see social privacy, which is going to say filter mature language, friend invite permissions, text chat, can receive gifts, which is going to say whether that is off or on. We're going to see our auto import friends, which is going to go ahead and say whether that is off or on. We're going to see your party joinability, which is going to go ahead and say whether that is off or on. Then underneath that, we're going to see gameplay privacy. And in gameplay privacy, we're going to see allow cross-platform play, which is going to say yes or no. We're going to see public game stats, which is going to say on or off then under that we're going to see hide your display name during re regular matches which is going to say off or on then we're going to see show season level in feed which is going to say off or on then under that we're going to see allow personalization of experience recommendations then under that we're going to see personalization of purchase recommendations and then under that we're going to see allow personalization of discover recommendations right and then underneath that we're gonna see um what do you call it? we're gonna see hide other display names during regular matches which is gonna say off or on then underneath that we're gonna see hidden matchmaking delay which is gonna say zero seconds or whatever it's on right so we're gonna see all of these different tabs all of these different options that you do have inside of account and privacy so now once we are inside of account and privacy and we do see all of these options we're just about to go ahead and get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite season 2 so once we are here exactly where I am right here right now what we're gonna want to do to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite season 2 super super easily and super super fast we're gonna go underneath where it says account and underneath where it says social underneath where it says account right and you want to go above where it says gameplay privacy and above where it says credit and legal you want to go over towards this tab right over here so under account above gameplay privacy called social privacy so make your way all the way over towards this tab where it says social privacy. Now we're just about to go ahead and get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2. So, once we are over here where it does say social privacy, what we are going to want to go ahead and do to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2 super, super easily and super, super fast, guys. This is super, super quick, and this is super, super fast as well to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2. So what we are going to want to go ahead and do to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2, guys, we are going to see Filter Mature Language, Friend Invite Permissions, Tax Chat, Can Receive Gifts, Auto Import Friends, and Party Joinability. So what we are going to want to do, guys, we are basically just about to go ahead and be on the final step 
to go ahead and basically get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2. So what we are going to want to go ahead and basically do now, guys, we are going to want to go ahead and go to the tab underneath Filter Mature Language, underneath Friend Invite Permissions, underneath Text Chat, and then above par party joinability and above auto and per friends, we are now pretty much just about to be on the final step. And we're just about to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2. To go over to this tab where it does say can receive gifts. So go to account and privacy. Go to where it says can receive gifts. Now we're on the final step to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2. So for the final step to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of Fortnite Season 2, go over to where it says can receive gifts. And you're going to see on you will be able to receive gifts and off you will not be able to receive gifts and you want to go ahead and make sure that can receive gifts is basically over towards the right tab where it does go ahead and basically say on then once can receive gifts does say on for the final step to get more refund tickets inside of four day season two apply the settings and now for the final step to get more refund tickets inside of four day season two once you do apply the settings back out back out so apply the settings make sure can receive gifts is on and now we're on the final step and we're just about to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of four day season two so for the final step to get ourselves some more refund tickets inside of season two open up the pause menu go over here go over to where it says reporting click report a bugger player and then we're going to click report a bug go down to the bottom click on other continue and accept and submit the report just like how i am right here right now then it's going to say thanks and then once you do go ahead and accept and submit the report just like how i do right here right now epic games is going to email you in a few minutes asking you what your problem is then you're going to want to go ahead and say that you had a certain amount of refund tickets that went missing you don't have any more they don't know how many refund tickets you had they can't tell and they're just going to go to basically give you them and since can receive gifts is on they're just going to go ahead and give it to you and they don't really know that you can't that how many refunds you had or you didn't they can't tell so it's going to say here you go and give you the refund tickets just restart your game you will get the refund tickets